North Shore. Please explain to everybody why y'all gonna repeat. Somebody take this question. We nice, man. I mean, we got all the pieces that we need just because we lost about three three key scenes last year. I mean, we we still got it just like before, you know. I mean, we got yeah. all the pieces that we need to run and go back to state. Yeah, everybody got better over the summer. Our defense gonna stay the same, and we just got longer, Ashley. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna be, we're gonna be nice. Talk about that run last year. Um, y'all won the Super 16. I, even even though y'all won Super 16, I don't think people thought y'all was gonna go far in yeah. state, win state. Did y'all have a chip on y'all shoulder the whole season? Oh yeah, that was yeah. at the beginning. Yeah, everybody just stay committed to the game. I mean, everybody was down on do pressure defense, everybody wanted to run, be all over the court. I mean, it was just that. Like you were saying, I mean, starting from the Sweet 16, the Super 16, I mean, once we won that, people were shocked already, you know? Yeah. And as we kept winning games, and then people just started to jump on and started to recognize. But once the playoffs came, we started taking names. I mean, that's just what we do. Yeah. We had a lot of doubt. We played with Chip. Everybody wanted to win. That's what basically carried us to a state championship. We yeah. really just had a point to prove, really. Yeah, because it seemed like Everybody knew Snoop was, everybody knew Brandon, everybody knew Jalen. Even though B. Green didn't play, you know, varsity the previous year, people still knew about him. Mm -hmm. You came out of nowhere. Yeah. What was that like adding that, you know what I'm saying, to the team? That summer, uh, it was back to school battle me. You got my first tape. I mean, that just built my confidence going into school. Uh, going to play, I have to play the center, the five spot. Uh, I didn't want to do it at first, but I. It made me better. I had to, had to think about it. It making me better and just trying to for us to win the state championship. I had to do it. So uh, it was it was hard, but I came out of nowhere. I, I just loved the the feeling. Just it was just my confidence, you know. It was just on another level, and that carried out to this summer before I got injured. So it was pretty cool. When y'all got to state last year, you know, sometimes like most high school gyms are like this, right? So it's just a small space, and you got walls all around you. But when you get when you get to UT, yeah. it's nothing around you. So trying to shoot on those goals, like what was that experience? Like everybody don't experience that. Oh yeah, like a state game, we, uh, we broke a record of 10,000 people. It was, it was amazing. Yeah. I mean like sometimes they like kind of get you with the clear backboards and you stand like right through, you just see faces. It kind of, it kind of like your precision, mm -hmm. your precision and depth kind of be off, but it was exciting. I mean like that feeling is one of a kind. Yeah. Playing in front of 10,000 people, you can't ask for the yeah. yeah. So It seemed like um, like y'all were a close-knit group, and like y'all mentioned, you lost a couple key pieces. But just seeing y'all play just last week, even without you being there, mm -hmm. I'm like, these dudes are still still good. Now, you came out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I just knew I had to step up. Somebody had to step up. I mean, couldn't take too long, man. Just had to be there and do what I do. Yeah, but but no, it's, it's got to be deeper than that because, mm -hmm. you know, where'd you play this summer? Rock Snoop. Okay, so maybe your hair grew or something. Because <laughs> I see y'all boys don't comb y'all hair. Yeah, yeah. Like, What's up with that? that? It's a new trick. <laughs> you got to wake up at 7, you think I'm going to pick up that? Uh, <laughs> school started at 7.15. <laughs> you got to go to that traffic. You don't got time. Mm -hmm. um, Snoop, it seemed like this was a summer uh, for you that... You know, not, not you didn't come out of nowhere. On a national scale, you did. So what was what was that like for you? You get a lot of attention, articles, interviews, people talking about you a whole lot. Have you been able to kind of? Cause it's hard for for you guys are 17, 18 years yeah. old. It's kind of hard to not fall in love with seeing your name on Twitter and thinking that you've done something. But you see a lot more to do. So I know your dad probably be on you. But how have you been able to kind of just maintain a level head? Uh. For one, turn off my phone. I mean, during the summer after that first July, that first July baby experience, had to turn off my phone because I was on the phone like six to eight hours, but it was just crazy. I, I liked it because I, I think I deserved it, but then again, I had to stay humble. I had to stay in the gym. I had to get my phone to my grandma and go to the gym with my dad. So it was real good though. It was a real good experience. What's up, AJ? You just gonna sit back there and you ain't got nothing to say about this? Be cute back there? You ain't got nothing to say to us? Light skin, light skin. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious, you ain't got nothing to say? Nah, just chilling. <laughs> <laughs> That's AJ for you, man. That's AJ. 
Now, talk about the dynamic of the team. So you got you got some teammates that motivate everybody. You know, you got some that um, a class clown, a clown of the group that like, kind of describe each other. Who's who? <laughs> we got a clown right yeah, here, man. He in, in his own way, you know. Not we got a clown. <laughs> but no, we really, we all really level headed, you know. Yeah. Once we get in the gym, it's it's another, it's, it's business, business, you know. Yeah. Once we, but uh, like on the bus, on the trips, or whatever, we all just mess with each other. Uh, yeah. Fall asleep, you mm -hmm. you gonna get terrorized with the camera. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we all we real cool. But last year though, we had some jokes, jokes. Yeah. Right. We really just chill. Still, yeah. Might be a little laughing now and then at practice, but any anything else, nah, no plan. Right? Mm -hmm. Is that coming from? Because a lot of times you take on the character of your coach. And so I know Coach Green is oh, he ain't playing around. So <laughs> is that kind of where where it comes from? The, yeah, the, the, the Coach Green, yeah, Coach yeah. Green, Coach Coleman. I mm -hmm. think more well, Coach Coleman. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yeah. Our defense coach, uh, like he like real straight. Well, he not straight. He'll joke around, but his attitude is straight business, and like yeah. we all. We all want to win, so we be focused. That's our factor right there for when it's state. Just yeah. defense and attitude. That's it. As long as we keep a good attitude, we gonna win. So can't nobody beat that press? Nah, never that. Tell it. Cool. Appreciate <laughs> it. Oh, before y'all leave, y'all got any uh, any shout outs? Shout out your Instagram, your Twitter handles. Whatever. I do got a shout out to uh, Cole Rehabilitation. <laughs> shout out to Doc Nala for on my rehab. So just. Look out. Well, uh, you know, follow me on the ground, on Twitter. <laughs> on the ground, I mean, on the ground, that other guy on the score 24 on Twitter. I'm somebody fixing that, you know. And follow me on Twitter, if all like Burks. <clears throat> That's it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, don't say nothing. Cool.